a better place oh, yeah. <laughs> is Golden Tiki. Of course. There's a clamshell we took photos of inside. All the lighting on the top. Pick your favorite lighting and report back to us. Which light is your favorite? That red one that just passed my head is one of my two favorites. It's hard to pick. <laughs> Again, this is the Golden Tiki. I forgot. I did the commercial for, is it 4949? Spring Mountain Road. That's right. Is that right? Yeah, they were a sponsor of Radio Vegas Dot Rocks, where we both used to broadcast from. I have to look it up. You can't miss it on Spring Mountain. It's in the same shopping center as Lee's, and uh, right, it's, it's at the corner of uh, Valley View. Thirty nine, thirty nine, Spring Mountain Road. There you go. <laughs> Spring Mountain and Valley View on the west side of Valley View. Can't miss it. They set many of the drinks on fire. Massive thanks to Brandon, the owner. Oh, Brandon was amazing. He came down and like we sampled like the menu. <laughs> he just made us feel like celebrities there, and I couldn't appreciate it more. The drinks were so good. There's the talking parrot. I couldn't put the audio here on the broadcast because the parrot says really vulgar things. <laughs> it's the same robotic parrot situation that was at the tiki room in, um, in. What is the place? La Disneyland. Disneyland. There's a yeah, bunch of Disneyland place. stuff there. Uh, I just want to pause a second to talk about the ovulus stuff. But they reprogrammed the parrot to say vulgar things that you couldn't say at Disneyland. And the beak matched and everything. It's amazing. <laughs> the uh, wallpaper in the ladies' room is interesting. A lot, a lot of naked folks. Uh, yeah. Penis doorknobs. <laughs> <press> handles. <laughs> uh, I had a, I found that. We, we were kind of, we were day drinking a little bit. Yeah, the men's restroom too. There's like skulls with waterfall time on them, and the wallpaper is also risque. <laughs> <laughs> um, here's the thing though. Uh, Brandon also told us that the place is super haunted, particularly this corner booth. We went in there with the Ovilus, and it gave us more words than it ever normally does. Yeah, it like normally I sit there and I get mad and I'm like, this stinks because it doesn't say anything. And I just wait like and then I just shut it off. But as soon as I sat in that booth, boom, or it just started spilling out. For the audio so. people, we'll tell you some of the things it said. It started with Shirley and Legion. I feel like Legion is something it's inclined to say when there's like more than one thing messing with it. Like a ton of, of spirits together? Yeah, like that's what Legion tends to mean. That's where the the I am Legion reference in the Bible right. refers to. Then threat and hundred. It also said straight bill and bacon. It's funny you pulled it up on your phone at the same time it popped up here. We're in sync today. We're having a good one. I well, love that. <laughs> <laughs> I, feel, I feel like it says bacon a lot around me. I don't know what that is. It's like, like why? There's a spirit that follows me around that's really into bacon. Maybe he's calling you a pig. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding. Well, I, so the straight thing, maybe it's saying, alerting everyone that you're straight. <laughs> he's like oh we finally got engaged to straight <laughs> bill maybe they wanted us to get the bill and get out of there and then they were calling us pigs yeah clearly <laughs> that's how i <laughs> interpreted that spirit so here we're looking at the shrunken heads particularly our buddy jay birds Aww, from radio vegas dot rocks there's ernest hemingway angelo moore professor professor rex dart tony felicia felicia hunter s thompson Tony was on the radio with us too. Billy the Crud, Nicholas Cage, <laughs> Las Vegas, Joe Esposito, famous Las Vegas folks, uh, Poo Poo Paul. <laughs> oh, there's Divine and John Waters. Here, it's going to slide over the next ones. Here we go. Got to give you a lot of peep. This is Al, Al Mancini. Asia, The Goblin King, Charles Bukowski, Ivana Blaze, and let's see, we'll move down to those ones. That looks like Kim, Kim Kardashian, but it's not. Chris, Chris Kyle. Kale. Kale. Kale, thank you. He's from Five Finger Death Punch. Oh, okay. And then Rob Zombie there in the upper, upper left. Awesome. Uh, some Egyptian There's, lover. Uh, Mayor Oscar Goodman and his. <laughs> Mayor Carolyn Goodwin. Goodman. <laughs> wonder, wonder what she tried There's just there. a poo there. Yeah. Clem Burke, Chris Stein, Debbie Harry. Nice. From Blondie. Now, I thought this was Carrot Top, but it's Melinda Shekels. <laughs> Walt Disney up there in the corner. Aw. Trader, Trader Vic. Vic. 
the Walt Disney one's legit looking. Will and Holly. Oh, is that Holly Madison? No. No. Evil Knievel. There's a mermaid. Lloyd. Oh, I'm not sure. I had to ch- chop it up real quick because there's a wiener in there too. Jungle <laughs> Explorer. Oh, that was the Jungle Explorer from um, Beetlejuice. I wonder whose mold of their privates that was. <laughs> and they had to shrink it, so. It was suspicious. Hey, ladies, I know who it is. <laughs> I, I think it wasn't the real. I don't think it was a real human one. It was too perfect. Oh, you've seen them. Flavor Flav. <laughs> <laughs> and there's Jaybird. Yeah. Yeah. So we had to give you a shrunken head tour. Definitely a fun place with a lot to see. And the drinks are amazing. So is the food. Absolutely. We didn't have any food, though. And the the prices aren't crazy, either. No, we just didn't have a lot of time to spend there. Super fair. So we'll have to make another trip. (laughs) Constantly, regularly. (laughs) 